Hey guys, welcome back to Freak Motion. Today's video is sponsored by AEGs. This plugin is already way too famous, and I think I don't need to say anything much about this product. Those guys who has not tried this plugin yet, I am highly suggesting you guys to check out the plugin once. This text animation is really simple, but this plugin helps me to make it more awesome. There are lots of free stuff there that you can use for your projects as well. So use the link in the description and make sure you check them out. During the video, I will show you how to use the plugin to enhance your project. So without wasting any more time, let's jump into the After Effects and let's get started. Alright, let's create a composition with standard settings, give it a name you like. Also 4 second duration is enough for this kind of animation. Let's take the type tool and type a text you like. You can use any font you like and color of your choice. Now open the text here, go to animate and add scale property. Change the scale value to 0. Open range selector 1 and change the offset value to minus 100 and add a keyframe on it. Then after 1 second, change the offset value to 100. Now go to advanced option and change the shape to ramp up. Also change both is value to 50%. After that you can get this type of animation. Now click on this add button and add anchor point. Change the anchor point value something like this and you can see the difference on the animation. Also add position property and change the position value something like this. Yeah, this looks good to me. On the text layer, add transform effect and change the skew value to minus 7 or you can use the text normal as well. Now pre-compose the text here, give it a name you like. On the text, we are going to add some effect. For doing that, select the layer, go to layer style and add inner shadow. Change the shadow color to darker tone of the text color. Let's add background for now, so we can see effect on the text clearly. Alright, now go to the inner shadow settings and adjust the value a little bit. You can add some noise effect on it, just like this. Also you can adjust the distance and amount of the effect here. Yeah, this looks good to me. On the same layer, add stroke from the layer style. and change the stroke color to black. Now on the composition, add an effect called Prostrate Style. Change the frame rate to 16. Now you can see the choppy text animation. This is optional, you can use it or not, but for me, this looks good with this kind of animation. Now duplicate the text here by pressing Ctrl plus D and you can rename it to Text Shadow. Add drop shadow effect on it. Adjust the distance. And check the shadow only option. Place the layer under the main text layer and our text animation is done. You can go to text composition. And change the speed graph to something like this. This looks fine to me. Our text animation is ready. 
let me show you how you can make it better with the help of AEGIS plugin. After installing the plugin, you can find the AEGIS Pack Manager from the Windows panel. Inside this, you can find their products. These are paid products, but they have bunch of free products which are really awesome. Like if you go through their starter pack, you can see there are bunch of animations such as transition, icon animation, background animation and lots of cool stuff. You just need one click to download the pack. It will just take few minutes to download. You can mark your favorite animations from the pack. I am going to use this preset for today's video so I mark them as my favorite. Also inside the paid version there are tons of animation which definitely going to save you lots of time. Let me go through few of them so you can get the idea from it. I am going through few of them real fast because if I try to cover all the video will be more than 1 hour. But just let me clear that all of them are fully customizable. So make sure you check out them all. You can get the download link in the description. Alright, let's back to the today's topic. As I already marked some of the presets for the topic, so I can get them easily from the favorite panel. I am going to use this background, so just need to double click on it. And it's ready. Just place it under the text. To change the color and all, just open the composition. And from the control layer, you can choose any color you want, just like this. Alright, let's add the wings. Same for this one also. Just double click on it and it's ready for use. Adjust the opposite a little bit because I want it to blend with the background. Also, you can change the rotation a little bit, just like this. It looks good. Let's add some stars on it. Change its color to white. Add the size and the position the way you need. We can make multiple copies of the star animation and place it randomly over the text. Just like this. And our animation is completely ready. You can see how much time I saved using this awesome plugin. So this is all for the today. I hope you like the video and, and make sure to check out the free starter pack of the AEGIS plugin. Thank you for watching the video. See you guys in the next video. Till then have fun and stay safe.